Hey guys, so today uh, actually what I have uh, reviewing is this uh, Tillian soap dispenser. Um, it's practically uh, obviously uh, the instruction guide. The bottle where you be putting the detergent. Um, seems to be the tube. But there's nothing else in the box, so uh, the pump itself. Uh, this seems to be our um, strong, I guess, <laughs> uh, tube of some type. All right, so uh, what I used to do, what I actually used to have was uh, a three sink faucet or three hole faucet here and I covered them with these little um, holders what it does is uh, you just kind of screw it in from the bottom just like this and uh, you know um, covers it up so what I'm going to do is quickly just open that up okay guys so there's a few things I learned tinkering around with the tube is that um, Check it out because it did not work. So this is for easy refill uh, for the bottle itself. So what you guys can do is actually put this in here, um, the tube directly, and you guys can see there's a way to screw it in directly into the bottle. And when you're putting it underneath the sink, the bottle can stay up like this. If you guys don't want to use the extension tube, so the extension tube is actually um, used for bigger jars, for bigger bottles, directly to insert this into the bottle. And, you know, you can use the stopper to go on top of it and cover it up for something like this. You know, it just uh, goes on top and this thing normally is supposed to sit on top. Stopper, so, you know, stop the um, soap from coming up. Also, there's uh, one thing I noticed that um, if you're using something like this, uh, moisturizing hand soap, just need to be careful of the viscosity um, because I put the tube directly in here and, uh, you know, the pump just does not have enough power to uh, suck it out directly out of that. So you guys need something um, a little bit more liquidy with less viscosity. That way, you know, you can put it in there and um, it just, uh, I mean, I, I guess it just makes it a lot easier to, uh, for the suction to be able to pull up the soap if it's more, um, you know, watered down versus something that has more viscosity that it cannot, it will not be able to pull up. Uh, maybe something like this, you know, it should definitely have no problem pulling it up. Uh, so let's test it out, see if it works. Um, not entirely sure how it's going to work, considering um, that's actually like a foam type, but um, let's see. Okay, that works. Um, so you guys can see. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and Let's see if this actually works. Obviously, I'll be installing it underneath it, but uh, just for the test uh, purposes. Um, I'll also just leave it right here. So you guys can see, um, comes down. The pump actually works as intended. I wish it would work, you know, with something a little bit more heavier. Um, but it is what it is, uh, you know, not really going to um, complain or blame the product. Um, uh, it works as intended, you know, um, it's just literally a simple pump. Um, 
entire job is to just, you know, suck soap out. Uh, definitely, we were unable to, you know, use it today with the soap, the hand soap that I have right now. But um, it, it works, you know, as we tested with the other one. Uh, um, so, uh, yeah, uh, definitely, you know, we'll give it a four out of five stars. Uh, solid product. Very, very easy to install. Uh, no issues there. So, that's another review. Thank you very much.